Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is Gabe with Indigo Software, genuine Microsoft software for less. So in today's video, we have a little hack for you guys. And what we're gonna be doing is approaching a update or patch on a Windows Server operating system as if it was a server without a graphical user interface. So kind of treating it like server core and running the updates that way is in our opinion, a much better way to approach this and it can make your life a lot easier. Now, before we get started with that, if you're interested in purchasing Windows Server, we have 2016, 2019, 2022 available on our website at a less than retail price tag. And you can check that out in the description box below. So without further ado, let's get started. So for the purpose of demonstration, I'm currently running Windows Server 2019, virtually using Hyper-V. Now the traditional method of patching your server would be going to the start settings and going that way to run the updates or patches. So in case you don't already know, open up PowerShell as an admin and we can just type sconfig. And this is kind of like looking at a server core version of the server manager. And then once you fire up sconfig, all you have to do is hit six. We can type A for all updates and I'll choose A for all. And this starts a text-based instance of Windows updates. Now you can see we have six pending and I'll just hit A to actually go ahead and run those updates. So if you weren't already aware of this, you can actually use this to update your servers uh, just on the standard configuration. And you can save a lot of time and energy uh, using the text-based, even on servers with a graphical interface. So that's gonna do it for this video. If you guys found it helpful, be sure to drop a like, comment, subscribe and share the video. Again, if you're interested in purchasing Windows Server, you can find those links in the description box below. So thank you guys for watching. We'll see you next time.